The new arms race isn't nuclear, it's hypersonic. China, Russia and the United States are battling for weapons that fly at Mach 5 and beyond, five times the speed of sound. Russia claims it leads. In 2018, Putin unveiled the avant-garde hypersonic glide vehicle, reportedly reaching Mach 20, and the Kinzhal missile, which Moscow says it has already used in Ukraine. Western analysts caution that combat data is limited, and some claims may be exaggerated. China has shocked the world, too. In 2021, Beijing tested a fractional orbital bombardment system with a hypersonic glide vehicle. United States officials admitted they were stunned, saying it circled the globe before striking within miles of its target. China now fields the DF-17 missile, with an estimated range of 1,600 kilometers. The United States, long focused on other programs, is now racing to catch up. The ARRW missile has struggled in testing but the Dark Eagle system, a hypersonic glide weapon with a 2,775-kilometer range, is expected to deploy with the Army soon. Experts agree, no country has fully mastered hypersonic weapons yet. Guidance, accuracy and costs remain huge challenges. But here's the question. If China, Russia and the United States perfect these weapons, does it make the world safer through deterrence? Or more dangerous than ever? Drop your verdict in the comments and follow for more fact-based comparisons of the weapons shaping our future.